going on YouTube? My name is Jacob. Welcome to 911% a channel where I bring you guys along on my many random adventures with my Porsche 911s. Today I'm down here in California at Laguna Seca for a Rensport Reunion 6. As you guys can see behind me, I'm in a whole sea of 993s. Today we're gonna go over some of the cars that have arrived to the 993 Corral on the Friday and the Saturday day. So let's check them out in greater detail. So right off the bat, you've got this Pretty sweet, Arctic white, I think. It's got a nice blue tinge to it. Barrera 2 cab. And then this gorgeous speed yellow turbo. And then here we've got a 993 that's been specced out like a RS Club Sport with a big Club Sport wing. Also, I see a color match DAS roll bar inside. And then these super cool phone dial rotiform wheels. Super cool. And then, uh, whoa, check out that sequential shifter in there. The RSR intakes, no bumperettes. And then right next to it is another Renlister's car. This is a pretty famous car on Renlist. I'm gonna put on the screen the Instagram handle. Absolutely gorgeous. Spent a lot of time and effort to build this car exactly to his spec. I mean, look at these BBS LMs. Also the over fenders. Look at the dish on these. And then of course, the super iconic ducktail. Also a DAS roll bar inside that's been color matched to some of the accents inside. He's got some hardbacks. All right, let's move over to John's car. I'm gonna put everybody's Instagram handle that I know on the screen. I love his new wheels, works. And then he just got this Club Sport wing. Car looks stunning. Speed Yellow Carrera with twists. This has to be a 96 or newer because there's no basket handle on it. Original condition minus the front bumper. This is a narrow body car with a turbo bumper. But regardless, looks absolutely amazing. And then this car is, well, I'll let you guys take it all in, but this car here is a convertible. But if you follow along this bottom here, you'll notice that it's actually a wide body car because it's a convertible turbo. But this car looks absolutely amazing, specced out this way, regardless if it's a, a build or not. Fantastic, it's got hardback seats inside and a boost gauge over there. Very cool. looks awesome and then moving along to this car right next to it you've got a another dark blue wide body car this time a c4s on gray interior i'll just show you guys some details here so no hardbacks but oh man i miss my car so much so this one has motor sound exhaust tips beautiful car and then we're gonna come over here and check out this polar silver Carrera with a bra on the front. I guess he must have traveled quite a bit to get to the Turin Sport. But love these Cup 2s. Tons of brake dust. I love seeing that because that means it's been driven from Oregon. So that's, that's quite a ways, I'd say. Very nice Carrera. Here we have a Carrera S with some gunmetal twists, the iconic split grille, 
Again, motor sound. Oh no, these are wide oval tips. And who's gonna come around here? Check out the hardbacks inside. I guess it's kind of hard in this light to see it, but uh, but actually, guys, here's an example of the difference in the two silvers in a 993. Right here, we have a polar silver, and here we have an Arctic silver. So the polar silver is actually a little bit more blue. Amazing. All right, moving along, we've got this Arena Red Carrera Cabriolet with the gray interior inside. No hardbacks. Still a gorgeous shape with some wide oval tips. Carrera two wheels. Awesome car. And then here is another Arena Red, this time wide body coupe on some gunmetal 996 turbo twists. I used to have these wheels on my Carrera 4S. Also has the tech art fog lamps and brake ducts. Bumperettes are still there. And here, let's go check it out in the back. These are the hardbacks in there. You can see. Beautiful 4S from Oregon. And then we're gonna move over here to this Targa with chrome wheels. And then the, I don't know what kind of tips these are. I do not think these are, these are stock. Car looks awesome. I love the basket handle. And then look at the amount of light that you get in with this Targa. The interior is nicely lit up for me, but it looks beautiful in this blue color. And then we're gonna move over here, polar silver on some fixie wheels. And then this is a narrow body car. Well, it's, geez, it's a Targa, so obviously but with a turbo S wing. Looks like he's got some fab speed motorsport tips. Very stock looking, 96 plus Carrera. The way you can tell that it's a 96 or newer is there's no basket handle. It's got the roof spoiler up here. But again, awesome car on Cup 2s. Over here we've got a Carrera 4. Similar spec, you know, same color as this one. Looking super sick. And then here's a turquoise blue, or no, not turquoise blue. This is turquoise blue metallic Carrera on some 18 inch turbo twists. Again, 96 or newer car because there's no basket handle. Gray on the inside. Looking absolutely sweet. And then this one has this bra on it. But let's move over to the other row. So here you have a, a nicely specced up Club Sport 4RS. This is a narrow body car with uh, the aero kit. You can tell the, the lips at the bottom there. OZ wheels. And then here's uh, the RS body kit underneath. You can see the little plastic lip. Looking pretty sweet. And then again, you've got like a Aero Kit 2 Turbo S type spoiler. And then back again to Arctic Silver Carrera. Seems to be the most popular color around here. Beautiful car. This is a Carrera S with again, some dark gunmetal 996 turbo twists. They do not appear to be, oh yes, they're hollow spoke. And a way to tell hollow spokes on these wheels is that the filler valve is actually metal on the solid spoke wheels, they would be rubber. Oh, my apologies, this is actually a 4S. Love the plate, no wasser, very cool. Some OEM wide oval tips. And then the Euro taillights with the amber turn signals. I like the look of this car, it's, it's really nice. Pretty savage. It guards red, I mean a 911 and guards red is gorgeous. It's also repping a Renless sticker. And then this car has the red seat belts inside. I don't know if you guys can tell there, but what an amazing looking car. No bumperettes, turbo S fogs with the brake ducts. Looks awesome. A friend of mine's gorgeous ocean blue. 
Carrera. He's had these Cup 2s refinished and I hope the camera picks up the color. But it's almost like a pale gold color that with the blue looks amazing. But let me show you guys one detail of this car. It was super sweet. So he had the badge and I don't know if it's gonna pick it up but the badge is the same color as the wheels. And it looks awesome. We'll move on here to the Guards Red Carrera with some motor, motor sound tips. Also the MY02 five spoke wheels, looks awesome. Ooh, nice uh, stone guards in black. Kind of a throwback to the 930. I love these wheels on the 993, I think. They're just like a perfect shape for the 993. Looks super cool. Over here we've got a gentleman. Maybe we'll come back to this one. I have a feeling this is a C2S as well. So we'll come back to that one. He's just polishing it up. No, this is a C4S with hard back seats. And badgeless. And then moving on to the blue one here. Uh, another Carrera, this is a 95 with a basket handle. 18 inch turbo twists on gray and blue interior. What I like about all of these cars is that it seems like all of them are being driven and enjoyed. Here's another Guards Red Carrera with the aero kit, the RS aero kit on it with the twin lip and then also this piece of aero here underneath. He's running some OZ Super Legera wheels. I hope they're Super Legera. And then the RS wing. So the RS had two wings, the Club Sport like I showed you guys before. And then this one. I'm not a big fan of wings on 911s, but I think this one does it really well. It almost has like a ducktail to it. Looks super cool. We've got ceramic coated black wide oval tips. I believe these are FD from Fister. Another white Carrera with a ducktail. And again, wide ovals. These are tech art wide ovals. And not quite sure what kind of wheels these are. And gray and blue interior. Car looks absolutely amazing. This has a Club Sport front lip on it. Looks cool. To another Polar Silver Carrera on Cup 2s. Oh yeah. Looking pretty sweet. And then I've got a convertible on, on RS speed lines. Turbo bumper with the Turbo S fogs. I think it looks awesome on the convertible. A Carrera white convertible with like a pretty cool Porsche top cover thing. I don't know if you guys see it. On some Targa speed lines. Looking awesome. So this is the Fister demo car. Authentic speed lines that he's got. I love the blue color on the calipers. Looks super cool. Very characteristic to FD. It's got the aero kit on it. And, you know, gotta give it a little polish there. Car looks awesome. Darren moved this car out because he's doing a parade lap, but I thought I'd show you guys this car with some interesting Gambala side skirts. Oh, maybe they're not Gambala. Uh, I want to say this one is Zenith Blue, but I may be super wrong, so don't quote me on that. It also has some 996 turbo twist wheels and a, a turbo bumper. And then we're gonna move over to the second row over here with some more cars, so we're gonna check out those starting with this Martini a Racing Stripe a white 993 on the sport design wheels. I like the livery, it's pretty cool. Blue top, blue interior. Looks pretty sweet. 
Carrera White Carrera S with some BBS E88 wheels. Look pretty sweet. Also clear side markers. And then again, these super sick tech art fogs with a brake duct. And look at all these bugs on the front. Killing bugs fast, obviously. Driven how it's meant to be driven. But what do you guys think of these wheels? Let me know in the comments below. These are one of the wheels that I was debating to switch out my LMs for, the E88s. Looks pretty, pretty amazing. And then moving along, we've got a black Targa on some Gambala wheels. Looks pretty cool. This is a similar spec to my C4S in that it's black on cashmere, but the greenhouse really lightens up the interior. This is a tip car, Tiptronic. Looking absolutely amazing. We've got this gorgeous car getting ready and then everyone's drawn to this incredible blue Speedster by Ninemeister. This is, I think, car number four. You can see the Tech Art wheels and then Turbo S ducts. It's absolutely amazing. And let's go check out the clamshell on the back. Hard back seats. These cars are pretty much rebuilt from ground up in England. So people send their cars down, their donor cars, they get built and then shipped back. Nine Meister is a very well-known shop. They do a lot of amazing work. They also use a lot of OEM pieces, like this clamshell here is OEM, which is really hard to find these days. Split grill, and then the iconic Speedster S emblem. I really, really drawn to this car. It looks absolutely amazing. And let's get the interior, shot of the interior for you guys. Look at that. Looks so amazing. All right, let's move on. There's a, another Arctic Silver Carrera on Cup 2s. And motor sound package. It's got the tips. Stick. Another turquoise. Man, I think this is our Turkish blue, maybe? Some of these colors are so similar, so it's hard to tell. So if anyone wants to correct me, by all means, do so. And then moving here is a very, very stock-looking 1994 or 1995 Carrera on some 16-inch wheels on gray interior. Awesome, with these little tiny narrow body exhaust tips. Another Arctic Silver on some fixie wheels. I don't remember what the model exactly is. I had these wheels in black briefly. They never made it on the car. And then here's a car that I've been following on Renlist for I want to say like the last 10 years. This car's gone through some transformations. Currently it is standing on some Speedline RS wheels, yellow calipers, the script, and this ducktail. So I, I want to say this is the first wide body 993 that had the ducktail back in the day. Uh, you see a lot more nowadays, but it just looks super sick. It's a nice Carrera S. And then I want to say these are the Tremont Cup replicas because they're so dished out, but I might be wrong if they're original. I really apologize. I don't see the script around the lips, so I'm gonna assume they're Tremonts. But again, I love the Euro turn signals on the back. He's got the original wide ovals. And of course, you know, some other subtle modifications. Also has a Turbo S lip. These clear corners, Turbo S intakes. Super cool car. Let me know what you guys think in the comment below. And then I met this gentleman as well. He's running BBS LM wheels in silver. We were actually chatting about tires earlier and fitment. I think 
I think his car is, is just badass. It's, a, it's an Arctic Silver 4S, wide oval tips. He's got a, a wiper in the back and the gray interior looks super sick. All right, and now we're gonna move on to this Midnight Blue Carrera 4S on stock height. This is how my car looked when I first got it. It was uh, essentially this kind of wheel gap. This was the US ride height or North American ride height. Uh, the car next to it looks like it has a rest of world ride height. Looks awesome stock. Yeah, let's walk to the back here. Again, on gray interior, no hardbacks. Motor sound tips. Car looks pretty stunning. Not quite sure what else to tell you guys about it. It's pretty sweet. I love this color. And then another Arctic Silver on turbo twists. This is a Targa. Not quite sure, maybe I even filmed this already? I'm not sure. And then this car here looks pretty sweet. It's a narrow body with, I wanna see these are tech art, tech art tips or maybe they're, no, they're, they're definitely tech art, I think. And then this car has some 996 GT3 wheels. Let me know what you guys think about them. They look pretty sweet to me. It's running Pilot Super Sports from Oregon, got a black badge. And yeah, looking sweet. So that's pretty much all of the 993s. The sun's out now, and there's a few other 993s that arrived, specifically this RWB, which I'm gonna show you guys in two seconds, but also a few others. There's a, a slate gray Carrera here, a 95. That stands out, pretty sweet. And then this gorgeous speed yellow. Yeah. Speed yellow, 95 with the basket handle. Very nice. And on some sport design wheels. And then cruising over here, we've got this RWB that I was talking about. Obviously they've got rows for the other models and it's kind of cross-pollinated because some people are just parking wherever. But just to give you guys a little idea of all the attending 993s, amazing cars, in amazing shape. I am so jealous. I really need to ship my car next time because I just feel really left out, to be honest with you guys. Awesome turbo right here, check this out, Arctic Silver. Looks like it's bone stock. Uh, parked in the wrong row. Looks awesome. But yeah, that pretty much covers the entire 993 paddock. I can't see any others. Oh my God, but wait, before we do anything else, there's like an... Right, so I hope you enjoyed checking out the 993s here at the Brent Sport Reunion and the 993 Coral, Coral, Coral. Corral, Corral, Coral, Corral. I don't know. But anyways, thanks so much for watching. I'm gonna end the video here. Remember to subscribe, comment, and like, and I'll see you guys next Thursday. Take care.